Well, it wouldn't really be a St. Patrick's Day without at least taking a look at one of the most unique tales, urban legends, tales of lore ever bestowed upon us on 99.7 DJX. I mean, honestly, if they haven't yet added it to the signs saying welcome to Mobile, they should. They're missing an opportunity. Uh, If you've never heard of the fabled leprechaun of Mobile, Alabama, buckle up. You're in in for a treat treat because (laughs) years ago, the neighborhood was up in arms and full of buzz because they thought they saw a leprechaun in a tree. So much so that the news reported on it. Curiosity leads to large crowds in Mobile's Crichton community. Many of you bring binoculars, camcorders, even camera phones to take pictures. <laughs> to me, it looked like a leprechaun to me. All I gotta do is look up in the tree. Who else in the leprechaun say yeah? yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, so they have full on like a party tailgate happening. There's people going, listen, um, this is a definite leprechaun. Everybody. They're getting the crowd involved. All We're that. all hanging out until he shows his face again. Yep. Eyewitnesses say the leprechaun only comes out at night. Ah, gotcha. <laughs> if you shine a light in its direction, it suddenly disappears. Oh, uh, so it okay. is It is kind of tough to, to catch. Elusive little critter. This amateur sketch resembles what many of you say <laughs> the leprechaun looks like. Now, can <laughs> Kelly... It, <laughs> If I were to describe what the police sketch looked like, it is a two-dimensional. Uh huh. It's just kind of like it's well, like it's it's a, something maybe even a preschooler. I'm not even going to say kindergarten. I'd say maybe even preschooler could probably draw. Like, it'd be a really advanced preschooler, but it's his like a round face. It's got a top hat because <laughs> it looks like that's, a leprechaun. That's, that's a that's telltale leprechaun. sign. Right. That's what yeah. leprechauns wear. Others find it hard to believe and have come up with their own theories and explanations for the image. Now, yes, so some are like, you know what, not convinced it's a leprechaun. My theory is it's casting a shadow from the other limb. Could be a crackhead. There it is. <laughs> there it is. It could be. It could it be could one be. of them, too. I mean, they got hold to the wrong stuff. That's right. Yeah. This is the leprechaun in Mobile, Alabama. Oh. And it told me to get up in a tree and play a leprechaun. <laughs> <laughs> the stuff told him to get up in the tree and play a leprechaun. Nah, at this point, that. stay off drugs, kids. Yeah. We're going to get down to the bottom of this. Yeah, stay down there, guy. Don't be afraid. Yeah, so there's a guy literally directing traffic. There's uh, he's he's taking money to direct traffic. They think maybe they found one of the leprechaun's flutes. Don't be afraid, man. This guy helping to direct traffic says he's prepared for his encounter with the leprechaun. <laughs> okay. He suited up from head to toe. Yep. This wards off spells right here. This wards off spells, he says. <laughs> this is a special leprechaun flute. Okay, Made so Made from like PVC. PVC, pipe. right. <laughs> <laughs> it could have been the crack pipe that the crackhead dropped. Who knows? This has been passed down from thousands of years ago from my oh. great great grandfather who was Irish. Yeah, why? We right. should believe him. Yes, we yes, should believe this guy. Thousands of years ago, and he went to Home Depot and made it. <laughs> I just came to help out. Others just came to get lucky in hopes a pot of gold may be buried under this tree. Okay, now this is the moment that you've probably seen the meme. Uh, go around of the guy wearing his cap on backwards, uh-huh. smiling. He's got grill. He's got a grilled teeth and all that. Yeah. Here it is. I'm going to run a backhoe and uproot that tree. I want to know where to go. Yep. I yep. want to go. <laughs> Give me the go. I want to go. <laughs> That's right. That's right. <laughs> That's really why we're all here. We're just hoping for a payday in the gold Listen, under the tree. That's where it's got to be. That, my friends, is the tale of the leprechaun in Mobile, Alabama. Honestly, we don't know if ever that leprechaun was ever captured. It doesn't sound like it. I feel like they would have uh, done a follow-up story if they did. Could be like- a crackhead. <laughs> That's right. Okay. And who else you know what? Say yeah. 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 You know who the real MVP of this story is? And I don't know if we've really fully given him the credit, but the reporter who really kept the game face on the entire time. Yes. I mean, 
professional <laughs> through and through <laughs> with all of that. And on. <laughs> on this St. Patrick's Day, may you all... I want the gold. Give me the gold. I want the gold. <laughs> yep, may you all find your pot of gold, just like the leprechaun oh, of Mobile, Alabama. Such a fun story. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we've got a little bit of it up at WDJX.com. If you want to take a look <laughs> on 99.7 DJX.